Hello soldiers, what is up? My name's Valent MC. How are you doing on this dandy day? Welcome back to another Minecraft SMP video on a Valiant SMP. And today we are gonna be making a shop coming soon, Brothers Limited. So that's me and my brother are gonna be making this one. Um well I'm gonna be doing a bit of making today, and me and Spencer are gonna be maintaining it. Uh that's Rage Kicks, my brother. Okay, so first of all, we've got to uh sort of make sure <laughs> front of slabs, I need to make some. Um, we need to make sure that this area here is um, f uh, flat. It's a nice blank canvas for me to work on. Um, I've got an idea of the design that I want to use, and it's sort of because. Let me explain what our shop's going to be. Our shop is going to be a potion shop with possibly some really high level enchantment books. For example, efficiency 5, sharpness 5, power 4, protection 4, no, power 5 I think it comes up to. You know, just generally the high uh, level in chance that people are going to want and people are going to pay the big dollar for. <laughs> okay, so um, the plan is um, it's going to sort of, because everything in it is going to be magic related, <laughs> um, a potions and en enchanting books. I mean, that's that's not real stuff. That's a little magic, and you could almost say witchcraft. <laughs> so that is indeed what we're going to be doing uh, today. We are going to be making a witch hut um, f in which will be the shop. It's going to be sort of a large witch shop, and it's going to be slightly strange, I suppose, because it's um. It's, it's it's quite a weird shape. This is very rectangular. I might push this wall back or something. I'm not really sure. I have to move these chests. But I'm going to go ahead and do some of that, and I'll see you in a minute. Okay, so now we have got a platform to work on. I pushed back the wall a bit, which has kind of exposed some uh, strange area. But that will be soon fixed. I'm going to put some, like, wood or something. I'm not really sure yet. Um, I think there'll be wood on the back. This is going to have an extra quartz block, but I didn't have one. And this is going to have wood in to cover this. And then obviously the scene is going to be normal. And the witch hut will be here. So I have a little bit more room to play with. It's probably going to be slightly further forward than the other shops. But not not really because of the way the witch hut's designed. This gas. Look at that. Ah! Um, <laughs> because the witch hut designed it's sort of like it will have stairs at the front. And then it will go to the main thing. But I'm not really sure how it's going to play out. I'll do it by ear. But I need to go and get some wood now. So I'll see you over there. Currently on my adventure to find some spruce wood trees so I can get myself some spruce wood for the witch hut. I found a horse and last episode I said that I needed to get a horse so I think this could be the guy. Um, <laughs> I didn't actually have anything on me to get him at the minute so that might have to wait till probably, it'll probably be next week by the time I actually get a horse but uh, this this uh, episode is going to be pretty full of me waking, making a witch hut but I think this guy could be the one, so I need to remember it's the electrics sort of base area. So, it's pretty cool. I've actually, um, on this voyage, been pretty cool because I've just randomly been walking. And the good thing about all of our bases being pretty close to each other, I've actually just walked past, like, everyone's house, uh, which has been really cool. I've walked past TJ's Pyramid, LG's Cathedral, um, some builds I didn't actually know what they really were, uh, Flaxen Shop and electrics and there's an his hourglass over there and this really cool looking uh, tower so hopefully I'm gonna run into a uh, tiger biome soon I I kind of knew where one was f uh, if I went through someone's portal <gasps> the donkey oh this is definitely where I'm getting my horses from um, but I knew there was one if I went through a portal but I didn't couldn't remember which portal it was I thought it would be easier to go on a voyage, but it's been pretty fun just running around the SMP, wasting my hunger and food. <laughs> oh, what's this? Oh, is this uh, is this Keppel? No, no. What? I think I might find a desert village. Right, let's see if this is explored. This is if this isn't explored, I'm gonna be very surprised because a lot of stuff on this SMP is explored. Okay, it looks pretty pretty explored from the fact that this has all been taken. Let's hop up here. What have we got? We got blacksmiths, we've got stuff on fire. The chest has been taken. Yeah, this has definitely been taken, but this is a pretty cool village. It links right onto a temple. 
But anyway, I'm going to carry on the search for a tiger biome. I don't think it's going to be anywhere near a desert. So I'll carry on the search. I've actually just ran into another... I hate my life. <laughs> I've actually just ran into another desert village. And this one appears to be unlooted. So I'm keeping that for um, whatever my horse is going to be killed. So that's that. Um, anything else really of importance in this village? might take some of this food because this journey has been really long <laughs> and I don't know why I've been taking so long. I can punch these. I'm not in MCSG. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and probably just cut to when... Ooh, Acacia. Um, cut to when I'm finished and back at my base uh, with the wood because this, this recording is going to be too long otherwise. I want to keep it around 10 minutes. Otherwise, it will take me a year to upload. <laughs> so, I will see you when I'm ready with all that. This skelly needs to die. Right, let's witness what happens to you if you shoot Ryan. Ah, you're gone. Anyone else? You want some? Right, I'll see you back in my base. <laughs> so, I've done a little bit of work to the hut area. I've I got a bunch of wood. I finally found spruce tiger place but there was just the odd tree and uh, I it just it, was, it wasn't too interesting I think I might because this door's off centered because I want the door off center because I'm pretty sure that's how witch hut is I think I'm not really sure <laughs> um but then this is centered so it's sort of strange but I don't know I'll leave it like that for now and we'll think about it I need some to oops <laughs> I need some torches and next is the roof I also need to do the back of here and such, but that that's fine for now. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is the kind of size that I'm thinking of. I guess you can kind of see what I'm talking about with the witch hut. It's not too witch hutty, but it gives the idea. And hopefully it'll look more like a witch hut once the roof's on. Um, so yeah, I'm going to also add some small details like, for example, the uh, plant pots or with, the, with mushrooms in and stuff, uh, because that's kind of helps you get the vision of a witch hut. I also, also almost got killed by a witch earlier um, when I was going to try and find all this spruce wood, so that was pretty pretty bad. <laughs> but um, yeah, I will go and finish off the roof, I guess, and probably get some stuff to do little details, and I'll be right back with you. And the witch hut is kind of looking like a big witch hut, actually. Um, it's sort of come together. I need to put some chests and stuff in there, but first, let's... Let me take a selfie. No, Ryan. No. Shh. Okay. I need to put a few torches up in here. And the flower pots. I've got five. I don't think I'll use all five. But let's just put a few down here. Uh, for now, I've got... I don't know if Netherwalk go into it. Nether... That would be really cool. Damn, no. Netherwalk do not, in fact, fit in. I uh, I need I want to get a mushroom, but I haven't been able to find one. Okay, I haven't got anything else on me at the minute for that third one, but that third one can just be bare for the minute. Actually, don't witch hats. You guys come back, come back here. Maybe they have this. I don't know if they have that, but that would be a better place to have. Let's do it like that. A better place to have these uh, flower pots. So you there, you there, and you can go there. And okay, we're, we're getting mushroom for that one at a later date. That looks better, I think. I'm not really sure. Um, let's now get some chests and put them inside. That would be a good step now. 17 chests. Okay, geez, that's a lot. I'm not really sure how I'm going to place these. I'll just place it like this for now, um, <laughs> because it's very. It's, this is very temporary. Sorry about this crap here. Anyone darks? I think. Sorry, dark for all that crap. But yeah, look, this is like a, if you walk past this, you could. I think you you would understand. It's meant to be a witch hut, right? I had some signs. I think they're over here. Come on, signs. There we are. Okay, so I'm not really sure what this shop's called, but we can give it a temporary name. Um, maybe. Maybe. Magic Brothers Magic Brewery for Pots and Books. There we go. It's a good temporary name for now. <laughs> I think I think this is now 
once the stock's in and everything, I might I should get a brewing stand actually. I think I have one at one of my bases. I'll put that in here at some point. But I think I just need to clear out this back wall, which is gonna be stupid quick with this this bad boy. Let's put some wood in this corner. How will this look? Oh goodness. Need to get rid of this flooring. You guys you guys can't be here. No. Nope. Deletes it all so quickly. I'm not used to this speed. It's a rush. Okay. I think I missed a block up there. It, it doesn't matter. Okay. We'll have to fill in this back. Let's quickly do that now. Okay, well, I've put in the wooden back. Uh, there's literally just this roof bit to go now. But I will have to wait until another episode because I can't get quartz right now. Um, and also there's a little quartz hole there. I can't even spare one quartz. You see how desperate I am here. <laughs> but yeah, all these uh, chests obviously are still empty, but you can see through this and it's not just a netherrack. Um, so that fits with the theme better. And I think it, it stands out from the other shops. As you walk in, thank god I got this uh, space from my old iron shop because it's nice and far forward. This stands out because all of these shops are quite modern, clay, uh, stone brick, quartz especially. Uh, the only ones that would re this would really blend in with is the ones at the bottom. But we're nice and high up, high up near the front. We're nice and near the front. So, yeah, this is our new potion shop. So, I think that concludes this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Generally have a really good time. And I'll see you next episode.